I mean, our last call, Lord, Lord. Last show, last call for the evening. Let me just say something, though. Somebody was like, oh, you keep voting for Democrats, you keep getting... Nobody's telling you can... I said vote down ballot. You can vote ADOS all the way down and you won't vote for any of them. But you will let everybody know that you showed up. And I think you have to show up for dog catcher. I've already said that. I've already said that showing up, there are referendums on the ballot. Ballot initiatives that are not a, that are not a person. You still need to show up for that. I said that. But let me say this. If you understand conservatism, I'm not telling you what to do. I'm just telling you what to understand. Conservatism is the conservatism of power. So conservatism is the act of having had power and losing it and realizing that you've lost the power that you have and you're acting to grab it back, and that is conservatism. We are not conservative generally because we've never had power. Because understand, Democrat, the Democrats usually throw more money at stuff. We're a group that needs and are owed monies. So we generally are liberal because of what we... Now, the problem that we have is that we have not taken the Democratic Party away from Nancy Pelosi, Chuck Schumer, and all the people who use us as doorsteps and doormats to get their initiatives filled. We don't use the Democratic Party as our party. We don't say, this is mine. I need my stuff. I need my black agenda. I need my everything. We don't do that. That's what we have to do. We have never had power to conserve. We have never been at the top of the hierarchy to conserve our privilege. That's why fewer of us are conservatives. I'm not slamming no black conservatives. I'm just telling you what it is. Read books on conservatism and liberalism and you see what it is. What I'm saying is that you can go and vote down ballot and you can. If ain't nothing on there, you can vote ADOS all the way down. But what I'm telling you and then you're not giving any of the Democrats because you showed up and said none of them worth my vote. But there's other stuff on the ballot. But the second thing is this. I keep saying this. It's not that there's something necessarily wrong with like a D as opposed to an R. The problem is every year what we let Democrats do is go give everything to somebody else. Well, you can't, we can't give you nothing. I'm sorry. Because Mitt Romney going to get in there. So we got to give everything to this group. We got to try to get the white blue collars back. We got to try to get the Latinos back. We got to try to get them back. All the time, we the ones who are patchworking your party together. Listen, if we vote down ballot all the way through this thing, y'all ain't going to win, Democrats. You are through. You are finished. And y'all gave us Trump in the first place, so you deserve it. We don't have to rescue you at all. You better get your stuff together. You better decide what you're going to do. You better give us an ADOS agenda that we can work with, or you're screwed. You have more than enough time to get it together, though. You have more than enough time to contact me, Antonio, or whatever. We'll come there, work, and write something out. You got time. But ain't nobody playing these games no more. But we just show up. Well, we got to do it. We don't want four more years of Trump. White people gave us Trump. Let them fix it. Fix your own mess. Clean up your own spill milk. You make messes all the time and then turn to Negroes like we steal your maids and say, get this up. For what? I don't work for you. I don't work for you in this political arena. You fix your own stuff. Get your own stuff up. You made a mess. Fix it. So, fam...